What's up, guys? So here's week two of my Road to Nationals prep. It's the second week out of five of this hypertrophy phase. Uh, uh, percentages are up across the board, about 5%, and rep ranges all went down across the board, I think two reps, uh, pretty much. So this is my AMRAP. Before this, I did two sets of 192 and a half or four, and on this AMRAP, I got seven, which uh, is pretty cool, because last week on my AMRAP at 180, I got uh, eight. So just a one rep difference between uh, these two. Um, the pauses, I feel pretty good about the pauses. That one in particular wasn't so great, but the others uh, weren't too bad. Um, these felt pretty pretty difficult, though. I'm having a lot of trouble uh, keeping my hips under me and staying upright. I'm hoping all the uh, front squat and high bar work I'm doing um, makes this a little bit easier. Here's some of the uh, conventional I've been doing. This is off about a two inch block. Um, my mobility is really, really awful with conventional. I've neglected it for a really long time, so I'm just doing it off these blocks to make it a little easier to get proper positioning. But even these I'm really not too happy about. I definitely am sitting down too much right now. My shoulders are a little behind the bar, um, but if I don't do that, I can't seem to get my back flat enough. Um, but even on these, I'm getting my back relatively flat, but I'm not completely maintaining it as I pull off the floor. Um, so hopefully it gets better, but you know, not too happy with these right now. Just hoping to get this a little stronger since I've neglected it for so long. And here is, uh, some tempo benching. I've been doing, um, nope, I, my mistake, this is two count pause benching. Uh, this is, I do two count pause benching after my overhead pressing on my first upper body day. So this was 135 for five. Um... It's still like way below the best two count pause benching I've done um, in the previous meet prep, but uh, in the previous meet prep I wasn't doing it um, after a lot of overhead press, so it makes sense that it's not as good right now. Uh, here is the high bar pause squat day. Last week I did 125 for sets of five, and this week was 135 for sets of five. Uh, really easy. Um, I ended up hitting the left safety with the left side um, on the first and last rep of this set, but. Uh, Otherwise, it still felt really, really easy. Um, depth is looking pretty good on these. Um, just trying to like really focus on staying upright, keeping my core tight on these. Because uh, high bar in the past has kind of bothered my back a little bit. Um, but right now with the belt and the lightweight, they're feeling really, really good. And I hope they stay feeling this good because I'm having a lot of fun doing these and hoping to keep progressing these 10 pounds every week. So uh, I think this is the tempo benching now. This is, yeah, this is 303 tempo benching, so a three second negative and three seconds on the way up, or a three count, not exactly three seconds. Um, just doing this to keep the movement pattern pretty pretty fresh. The weights, it keeps the weights pretty low, so fatigue isn't too much of an issue uh, on these. Just is nice to really feel out the uh, movement pattern. Um, you can definitely clearly see from this that my left shoulder blade isn't re as retracted as my right one, which is definitely something to think about. Uh, here is my pause deadlifting. This was 220 for four. Wasn't super happy with the pauses on this set, like especially that second one was kind of not even there. Um, but otherwise, they're still feeling really good. I'm doing all of these with straps right now because I'm going to make the switch to hook grip. I just need to get some chalk um, in the mail so I can start practicing it a little more. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think with mixed grip, uh, I always end up flexing my bicep a little bit too much, and it's going to just cause imbalances, and I think long-term hook grip is just uh, the better way to go anyways. So uh, this was my second set of 224, and this felt much better. The pauses look way, way better. Um, and just overall, I was really happy with the set. I'm hoping I can get my uh, pause deadlift into the 300s before I go back to... Uh, regular deadlifting. Uh, here's some push pressing. I do this on my last upper body day after some dumbbell dumbbell benching. Um, really just kind of doing this for fun right now. Uh, just trying to increase my overhead press, hoping to see some carry over here. Uh, these are a lot of fun. I'm really, really bad at them, but hopefully I get better. Uh, so now the weekly volume. Uh, it's pretty much exactly the same across the board. Um, Slightly higher on squat this week because um, I did a little more accessory that I skipped last week. The bench and OHP went down just a little bit, which makes sense as the percentages went up and the rep ranges went down, but it's like super close, like within 500 pounds. And the deadlift volume, I think, went down just a little bit. But again, 
makes sense. And um, like all the numbers are really, really close.